Hey guys, so here we go again for match number three of the same event, Grappling Industries. So, same match, same everything. Uh, I'm gaining confidence, you know, I'm starting to beat people. And, um, yeah, this time I actually knew my opponent. Let me just uh, start the footage here. So, um, yeah, Mohaned, I met him at Submission Arts United. A uh, real good guy, real gentleman. Uh, you know, he offered me to, to train with him, and I, I did the same with him. And, uh, we met again uh, at the uh, no gi event uh, that you'll see later on. So uh, we shake hands, everything. Uh, again, I pull guard, hold the sleeve, just sit my ass down. I pull him in. I try to do like a weird butterfly here, but I, I feel like I can't really get it. So I go to a deep half guard. See how I'm staying flat though? I'm like, I'm not being super active. Um, uh, yeah, I should work on that. Uh, but as I said earlier, I can. If I'm comfortable on my half guard, I can regard super easy. So I, I do. I choose to do that. So I, I go with my, my full guard and I start working again the collar, uh, not necessarily to choke him, uh, just to control his posture and to to make sure that he's not um, passing my guard. He's not putting pressure on my ankles or anything, doing anything uh, funny. So right here, I I, I try and go high guard. And he does a good job of defending the triangle, but he puts himself into the omoplata. You'll see he's, he's turning the corner, turning the corner. He's putting a lot of pressure on my ankles, so I bail on it, and I go for his shoulder. There's no point in putting a replay here. It's uh, He just turns the corner, and here he's trying to pass his leg over. He's going to do it at some point, but I know he will, so I'll just flop onto my stomach and get on top usually it's a clean transition but he manages to, to catch me under the armpits I, I sort of have a little, a little laugh about it we're stuck in this uh, this weird donkey guard position so I try and I put my left foot into his ass to try and posture up just to put pressure on, on the ankle just for, for him to let go I, I know he's not comfortable I'm sitting on, on his on his chest and you know I get a little kick there um, and here I slide off to the left, trying not to get into the guard, and I manage to do so. I think I get points for that? Not exactly sure. Doesn't matter, I got some points at, at some point. And just a clean mount, you know, knee on belly, pull the elbow, get the mount, and I pancake on him. Um... You know, just to, to put the pressure and make sure he's not doing anything. I, I don't really grave on his feet. I have long legs and he has short legs. And uh, I'm pretty high on top of him. So, see, he's going for it on, on my left leg. He's sort of trying to, to mess with it, trying to bridge. But, um, again, I don't think he can do it. I'm more or less going for uh, Americana here. He's, he's turning, trying to do it. Ariane, get your face out of there. Yeah, bottom left, that's area, and she's, uh... So here, I'm, I'm more or less going for an armbar. I, I don't feel it's it's tight. So I... I kind of go for it, but I bail on it, and I go for the back. And... I mess up, so I reset. So I reset back to side control here. Not exactly where I want it to be, but... Um, I'll deal with it. So I do the nice uh, half guard escape here. Put the right knee inside. Use it to pry my leg open. I keep control of, the, of his shoulder and his pants. I do the escape. Keep him pinned. And yeah, he's trying to catch my head again. I'm not going to let that happen twice. So, right here, I'm trying to pin his left arm, and there it's pinned. So I fake the mount, and I pin his left arm, and now I'm, I, I have his whole right arm all to myself, to Americana. So right here, I'm just trying to like establish a good control, trying to pin it, and there's the tap. Um, again, Mohanad, like a super gentleman. He was like way smaller than I was. I think I had like a good 10 pounds on him. I cut a little bit of weight for this fight, and uh, he cut none. I think he came in at like 151, 152, and uh, after I regained the weight, I was like 162. 
163, so I had like a solid 10 pounds on him. It allowed me to move him around and stuff, but uh, yeah, and you make friends uh, in the sport, so I'm really happy I, I got to fight him, actually, this time, because I didn't fight him last time, and uh, you know, we got to fight again at the, the no-gi, and same thing, you know, great guy, great gentleman, we talked the whole fight, he gave me some, some figs or something, because he, he knew I was hungry. Um, so yeah, you know, that's, uh, that's, uh, my third fight, and, uh, that put me in the title contention, and, uh, I got to fight for the finals after, and, uh, you'll see what happens then, so hopefully you'll uh, watch next one as well, and as always, have fun.